I guess in some sense that a lot of people like that have hurt me. And I really like to have someone who would like to see me. They like to be a friend to me. Show some kindness. And take away the thing of feeling sometimes, you know, I feel like sometimes God take me. I guess I sometimes just want to be hold. I just want to be be by to watch a movie to you know what I say to cover the gather be close to someone I don't know I, I I'm more wanting a friendship than sex I want a long term relationship sometimes having a friendship can work into a boyfriend relationship can work into some sense of roommate. At some point a person helped me out some sense. I don't know. To have any support. He may open doors that it's not opening doors for me now. So that's what's going on in my mind feeling. I just sometimes I travel to San Francisco and make videos for YouTube and I'd rather have a place to, to visit, to hang out, a friend, a lover. I like to give something to him that he can't wait to see me. He can't wait to, for me to call him up and tell him I, I got home safely. I like a guy who say I can't wait for you to come back and see me again. I need to make him feel like I'm a good guy, a lovable guy. I need a door open. And I wish this guy allowed me to see him. I don't know. That's all I can say. So, it's just me and Melko. I need help with I hopefully that I have strong faith. I like to meet someone at Ocean Beach. I like to meet someone who has good faith in God that, you know, when he takes me sailing on open water his kite, that he'll believe that the wind and everything else will keep us above water. I don't know. I just like the idea to be attached to his body to, to the kite pulls across the water. Other things I wish sometimes is meet someone who has a motorcycle and take me a ride around town, do me a wheelie, and a speed too. Sometimes I can have a guy who has a dirt bike and make it highest jump. I guess I just like to have to be close to someone. So that's all I can say. I, I tell you the truth, my friend in Canada, I wish he was in love with me. Wanting to, wanting to move down here, start a new life down here. I guess I just, I guess all I care about is just getting out of this place. I guess I just, I guess I just want to live with someone else. I don't know. I just need a miracle. Is it too late for miracles? So I don't know. See what happens. To so this guy who's on gay dating, I almost want to pay 20 bucks or more money so I can see him. I just want to have a, I guess I just want to plant a seed so I can see him again. Don't have to pay. But then thinking about, should I pay for love? Should I pay for friendship? I just want to be with someone. I want to give to someone and love someone. I want someone to feel the same way. Since I wish somebody moved down here, get a place for himself, 
They like me to move with him. I don't know. Yeah, I'm so that's all I can say. All I need is a miracle. I just pray that I talk to someone at Ocean Beach and when I talk to him about what my bucket list wanting wanting to achieve, they have faith that you're not going to drown. You have to trust in God and to take me. That I can convince him that I won't fall off of him. You have enough straight, enough faith in God. Somehow God talked to him and said, "Take him." And I can tell everyone else that God can move mountains. That's why I need the thing to happen so I can tell people that God can move mountains. I believe God's going to let us drown. And I think I, I'm, I got this the way I wanted. I'm trying to walk. I didn't get the hype I wanted. I wish this room was alive. When you see this video, you see me on top of it. You ever dream that you're on top of this room? At your own place and wish the room was alive? Have you ever wished that the room will lift off the bed? And you and you'll be attached to the balloon. Or oh, oh, sometimes they would dream about having a whole bunch of balloons with strings and something take you off the off the ground. Have you ever be like to be raised? Almost like the balloons alive and give you a lot of your life. Okay. Time, time to get off this thing. Eight forty three PM. Start a little bit seven. Uh, for your information, I have no internet at home, so libraries don't have no webcam. Libraries don't have um, speakers. And I don't carry headphones, 
so uh, it's best to call me and talk to me on the cell phone. And if you are willing to set a time we can meet, I more care about that than talking on the phone or whatever.